So here's a car thermostat, and as it sits here right now, this would be the way it would be in your vehicle when the car is just sitting there cold. Now as it heats up, uh, your engine heats up, the coolant heats up, <clears throat> what happens is the temperature sensor in here will cause this to open up. Um, <clears throat> right now it would be in the thermostat housing and water would not be able to flow through this because it's closed up here. Now the next shot that you're going to see I'm um, actually uh, boil water and put the thermostat in it and you'll notice that this portion up here where the pin is that rubber portion of it there you'll see that that actually moves down the spring compresses and when this moves out of that part there this moves this part here moves down it opens up and allows coolant to flow through the thermostat itself and through the engine to cool the engine's temperature down. Okay, the temperature in the uh, on our gauge panel is indicating about up to halfway. I can still put my hand on the return hose for the radiator, but it is getting hotter. So I'm starting to think maybe our thermostat may be okay. But it's definitely getting hotter now. So I'm suspecting that the thermostat is operating and letting uh, the, the um, coolant cycle through the engine. And our uh, hose to the upper part of the radiator here is now so hot that I can't actually lay my hand on that for any length of time. Again, I'm not eliminating anything. Strange things can happen. Thermostats can be intermittently working or whatever, but at the moment I'm thinking because that's hot, that generally indicates the thermostat is open and is let, letting the coolant flow through. But I am wondering about that fan and the control circuit for the fan. 